meet up number two. And my trials are gonna meet a few people and we're gonna race. Well, it depends on who all shows up, really. Y'all heard any gunshots or anything like that around here? No, sir. Everything's been fine. Yes. This is my two-step. Thank you for your concern, officer. So, uh, anyways, we are out here in Lake Charles. There is a Dodge Demon right over here. He said he's got a few things done, but won't really say too much about it. And uh, he wants to run. So we've got obviously a ton of people around us that are gonna come follow us. We're gonna go do a few runs real fast and we're gonna have Jake who's recording. He'll be in a camera car. I'm gonna try and get a GoPro on my head so I can record a little first person. This is like my heart is pounding, bro. I've been waiting on this for so long. This is crazy. Y'all ready? I think this will top. Which, oh yeah, this is gonna top everything. This is crazy. This is like the flagship car right now on the market, so. All right, let's load up and roll out. We're gonna be racing probably down that way. We'll, we'll be coming right back though, so. I'm gonna see the demon race. We're gonna try and do 60, because I'm on street tires. I'm not, I don't wanna spin out and hit him. We can go a little bit slower. I'm just worried, because like I said, I'm on street tires, it's been raining. I really don't wanna, because last time we were here, were you with us last time? You saw that, huh? Oh, yeah. Last time, whenever I almost sideswiped that GT500 going down the interstate. So I'm trying to avoid doing that again, especially with that car, so. It looks too wet for me. I'm not going to do it. Yeah, same here. Everybody said it's dry, so we'll find out. Y'all ready, though? Yeah. All right. But they, they drive. Well guys, we are on our way to our designated spot for racing real quick, and um, I'm not gonna lie to you, I am pretty nervous. I've never ran a car nearly this fast. The Dodge Demon is like the fastest thing on the street right now. Everybody knows how fast they are. I've ran bolt-on Hellcats with slight mods, but um, nothing ever that was anywhere close to this Demon. The Demon is a completely different animal. You guys saw in last video what this car made on the dyno, so we're gonna see how it stacks up against the Demon. If the dyno numbers are correct, this should not even be a close race. Do I think that I'm gonna win though? Probably not. These cars are way faster than what they're made out to be. Either way, it should be a blast. This is gonna be crazy. I'm also pretty happy with the fact that it is relatively cool outside tonight. It is 80 degrees as you see right here. So it's gonna be really good for boost. That's exactly what I need right now. Gosh, I'm nervous, dude. This is by far the fastest car that I've ran. One time, yeah, you know I gotta go in on this one. You know how I do it though, you already know. I've been feeling like, I've been feeling like, I've been feeling like I'm ready for the top. Got the pedal to the metal, I've been grinding non stop. Killing every instrumental, and I knew just what I wanted. Now I gotta go and get it, and I'm never looking back. Only looking where I'm headed, and I doubt it for a minute. Trying to get another win. I burned a lot of bridges, but I know that I can swim. I don't need nobody else. People trying to take my credit, I can do it by myself. Cause I got it all embedded in my mind, I'm a psycho. Trying to get it right though, trying to save my time. I've been feeling like I'm Geico, balling in my prime. I've been feeling like a Michael, trying to get another comma, but it ain't a typo. Know that it's coming, I gotta keep on it. Here we go. crazy it scared me so bad because we lost traction at first it held traction in fourth and literally just walked the dog on that car that's the fastest car on the market right now and it just completely just said goodbye i'm on street tires i can't even hook fourth gear was a little bit sketchy at first and then straightened out and we literally just freight trained away from that car that is a dodge demon dude 
Well, the dyno chart seemed a little bit high and I was kind of unsure about how I felt about it. The car dynoed at 1,014 wheel horsepower, if you guys didn't see, and I was kind of like, there's no way. After running that car, knowing what that car puts down, and seeing that I just literally left that car like nothing, I kind of am starting to lean to believe it. It's a little bit more accurate. Dude, third gear is like the power perfection right there. I am like pulling hard. Yeah. Fourth gear, I had to start at fourth because it bogs the car down a little bit, so it's not as much power, so it'll let it smoothly take off. If the roads were dry and I was on a drag setup, dude, this car from a third gear roll would have just disgustingly killed that car. I would have felt awful, dude. Like, all right, bye. <laughs> we done. <laughs> we out. Oh, there's a cop. Oh, turn off the light. Turn off the light. Oh, God. All right, let's get out and go check out and see what happened. Oh, my God. Third gear was, no, we, we literally lo I lost it and we started facing your fender. I was like, oh, oh no, no, no. So what did he say when he walked out? First thing he said. None. He just said he had fun, whatever. I don't know if we're gonna race again because so I don't want to redo that. That was not cool. That's, yeah. Bro, that first run, I, th I, was, I called it quits with life, bro. <laughs> I was done. You thought you were dying? Yeah, bro, I thought we was dying. Well, oh, this dude, man. Uh, six car lengths. Six car lengths from the demon? This guy, so yeah, six car lengths from the demon. We have like uh, officially playing. taken over this entire gas So station. what happened? Yeah. And who won? Probably five to seven car lengths in front. Like that was, I started screaming, bro. Ooh. We tried it in third. Whenever we hit it, uh, you have to watch his video. He's in the backseat videoing. It seriously, I hit it, and we started like I faced one way, faced one way, the whole car slid, and then started facing him. And I was like, no, 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 no. no. I know, man. <laughs> Dude, that seriously. I can't even, my stomach like hit the ground. I was like, that's the problem with uh, what dyno, what it dyno today on those tires. You need to fix that. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh yeah, we're blocking traffic guys. They're just trying to get their McDonald's seat. Yeah, we were in 60 and that third and third, and it was just like I didn't even have tires on the car. I know we had to we had to literally start in fourth while it was at like 2,500 RPMs and just roll into it. It was like, okay, we're moving kind of, and then it's like really picked up, and then we just Wait, like so soared past him. He hooked. It looked yeah. like it. He I didn't hooked. see him spinning. So no, he didn't spin at all. He no. was golf. So do you think that the dyno numbers are accurate, or at least closer to accurate I, now? It's okay, kind of what is that at the wheel? No, yeah, yeah, it was like 840 the crank. 842 at the crank, so it's probably like 780 at the wheel. Well, I would assume. I think yeah. dynos from this morning are accurate. It might be all traction. <laughs> See, okay, so that's with him in there. That's with the race drugs. That's with everything. No traction. That's a lot. So imagine if the car actually hooks with, no, with limited weight, like really low weight. That's gonna be scary. Well, guys, we are headed back to our meat spot that we started at. We came and did a few runs, and then we stopped at this gas station right here where. We could all stop and talk about what happened. A few months ago, the first time that we came out here, he said that he didn't want to run because he was trying to break the car in. Well, then I came down here tonight. And I guess everybody got him hyped up because they were like, dude, there's a Mustang coming down. And he was like, I ain't never seen no Mustang beat a demon. And I was like, all right, man. So he came out here and showed up on drag radials and skinnies in the front. He was, he meant business. I really plan on doing this a whole lot more and going and racing a lot more cars because I know that's what you guys are interested in seeing, especially because I haven't done too much with the Mustang recently, but um, after the dyno video, I was eager to run some cars and see how it stacks up against other things. Needless to say, it's uh, it is pretty impressive. We're definitely going to be trying to find a lot of cars and keep the dyno numbers on secret and see if we control a lot of people because like he said, he's never seen a Mustang beat a demon, so I'm kind of curious of how many other cars we can line up against. Also, I know I keep saying this, but I've been waiting on these drag wheels to come in before I can go do any more uh, track days. Weld takes forever to get wheels back in stock. They're on, they've been on back order for like 10 weeks now, so I'm about to just abandon that and go with um, another brand like Race Star, maybe get some Dark Stars or something like that. But um, I was really wanting to get a set of welds, but they're just taking forever, so I don't know if I'm going to go with them. So anyways, guys, that's pretty much the status update for what's going on right now. We're headed back to the meat spot, like I said, so I guess we'll talk to you guys when we get there.
turn me to a money hungry fiend. And I lose my sight of vision, getting focused on the streams. I've been trying to make it happen back when I was 17.